All right, boys, we're back. If anybody's ever wondered how to fill their cooling system, we are going to use a vacuum fill setup to fill this 7.3. Couple of things you're gonna do at the same time, you're gonna fill the coolant. However, you are also gonna be able to check for leaks because if you could not pull it down into a vacuum, then that obviously means that you're not sealing. So we're gonna get this hooked up. We have fresh extended life Zyrtec antifreeze for this 7.3 concentrated we got two gallons of coolant and two gallons of distilled water so we are going to start the process we had the air compressor hooked up and charged and what we had to do was find in the kit the rubber grommets to seal all the way around on the degas bottle or wherever you fill the coolant up and we are going to hook our air up and we're going to show you how it pulls the vacuum down Gonna have a little bleed tube. We'll stick that into the body. So you can see it's gonna go all the way into the green. You can see the hoses. It's starting to collapse. Once it gets into the green, we're good to go. I'm almost at 25. Completely pull the vacuum down. Gonna make sure it holds here for a little bit. Again, if we could not pull the vacuum down, then that is gonna indicate us to us that we have a leak or something is not sealing. But for the most part, it looks like it's staying pretty steady. So we're gonna get our other hose hooked up right here, and we'll draw the fresh coolant in via this line. This will go right to where the the airline was. All right, we're gonna hook this up to the vac fill kit, and we need, we need to move the jug of coolant a little closer, so we're gonna maneuver that. But let's take a look at the gauge. Still sitting good. Definitely holding vacuum. fresh coolant line in the bucket and once we open up that valve that vacuum is now going to draw all of this coolant in to our system I don't really do this on six sevens more so just wanted to demonstrate to you guys how to use the vac fill system this can be used on any car just to make sure to use the right mixture of coolant. Tell me what you think about this in the comment section below if any of you guys have ever used the vac fill. Let me know what you use it on. I'm curious. Thanks so much, you guys. Remember to like, comment, sub, share, and I'll see you guys all next time. See ya.